Welcome back everyone and thanks for joining me for another episode of my Manchester United career on FIFA 16 and it's first versus second. Leicester top of the pile after 13 games gone. We can go top if we win. It's a game that we should be winning really. I mean we've got Middlesbrough coming up next. These next two games, they're games that you need to be winning in a season. So this is the lineup I've gone with at the back. Phil Jones, small in. Paddy McNair comes into the side. I've got Yanazai and Memphis out in the flanks with Pereira and Schneidlin in midfield. And Rooney, Martial and Wilson start in attack. Now let's have a look at why Leicester have been performing above all expectations so far this season. I think it's Andy Carroll that stands out the most after signing for West Ham. Him and Akazaki really getting a partnership going there. Really finding their groove. Bit of a fresh attack really. And they, they've been scoring the goals, finding themselves in top spots so far. But I think we've got enough about us here today to get the three points. And Schneidlin, nice simple pass there to James Wilson. Lovely, bit of space for Pereira. Let's give this to Rooney, it might go for a shot here actually. Oh, wow. It's a Wayne Rooney special with just three minutes passed. Absolutely sensational. It had perfect power, perfect height and dip to put past Kasper Schmeichel and that's got to knock Leicester's confidence now for the rest of this game look at that for a goal pinpoint accuracy right up into that top right hand corner Kasper Schmeichel well and truly beaten Alan Smith kicking off after seeing that on the commentary best start we could have hoped for that up to Schneidlin he's been really gluing our midfield together ready for our attack and just look at this passing now We've been given so much freedom from Leicester. They're going to pay for it eventually. Here we go with Rooney. I might go for another shot. Oh! oh! <laughs> almost did it again then. Almost made it two. Even with just 22 minutes gone, Leicester look dead on their feet. They, they, there's no challenge coming from them whatsoever. And sh look. Poor challenge. He couldn't even chat. Oh, here we go. Space for Schneidlin. Oh, just couldn't keep that ball under control. They're getting a bit more possession now Leicester but we're going to win that back here we go on for James Wilson one on one with Casper Schmeichel and that's what I'm talking about 2-0 to United half an hour gone and what a finish from James Wilson he looks so confident on the ball especially when he struck it I mean he was put, put under a bit of pressure from Casper Schmeichel who tried to come out make himself look big put him off his game but he just lined up his shot. He knew exactly where he was going to place it. And just put it into the back of the net. I love cool finishes like that. Very Van Nistelrooy-esque, if you will. In lot. You know, Leicester, they've dominated the league so far with 13 games gone. They're not dominating today. It's all Manchester United. And we could be on for a third. Rooney was gearing up for the shot. Oh, free kick, really? Where's that going? Oh no, we need to be careful. Don't want to be giving away a free kick there. But we don't want to be giving it away a goal here. Akazaki, they're moving the ball around so nicely. They've come awake in the second half, to be fair. I mean, look at that for a, a pass. Was there any need for it? Danny Simpson. Look at this. Oh, still can't clear it. They're going to get a goal back if we're not careful. Yes, thank you to Haya. They're looking dangerous. They are the comeback kings, especially in real life under Claudio Ranieri. It's still 2-0 though. Pellet. Let's get the ball rolling. Here we go. Oh, yes. It's got to be. It's got to be 3-0. Come on, we'll go for the sweaty goal. Pellet. What are you doing? Side netting, but it's a penalty. We've been given a penalty. If he had just left that, James... It wouldn't have got to Rooney. If he'd just left that, it would still be 2-0 as Pella missed his shot. Captain Wayne Rooney to get his second goal of the game. Go for the top left. There we go. 3-0. The game well and truly put to bed. We will now be coming away with those three points. Are they going to get a goal back here? Just a consolation at the far post. Akazaki. Side netting. And that is full time. A good win all around. We absolutely dominated Leicester. They have dominated the league up until today. 
as they uh, came to Old Trafford and they've lost. They've dropped all three points. We will now take top spot where we belong with this 3-0 win over Leicester. Okay, um, who, sh who else shall we go for? Paddy McNair, who did really well in that previous game against Leicester, even kept a clean sheet as a defender. De Gea didn't even concede in that. We'll go for... Third bottom, Go for dri with nine dribble points. course, maybe. Bottom, Hull City so we've already got him down for Fifth bottom, West Al Rondo. With uh, what else shall I put him down for? Dribble course. I'm keep possession. He did lose the ball once or twice against Leicester, so we could probably work on that. So a good, yeah, really good session overall, apart from that D from Wilson with his sharpshooting, but looking really good for Paddy McNair and Tyler Blackett as well. We want to try and get involved a bit more. So here is the league table as it stands with just 14 games gone. And after beating Leicester, we are top by two points. Up next, we've got Middlesbrough, who are also doing well in the league so far. They're in fifth. But at the bottom, you've got Southampton, Sunderland and Newcastle. Here we are at the Riverside. Middlesbrough versus Manchester United. They've always been a bogey team, even in real life. How are we going to fare today against Middlesbrough? They've got Ensue, Darmia, Ayala at the back. They're bitter. For sure, Adoma, Stuart Downing, and Stuani up front. Yeah, I, th I think we've got enough about us. I mean, we're in fantastic form. And this is the team I've gone with. Patrick Herman comes into the side. Memphis retains his position as well in the starting lineup, as well as Rooney Martial and Wilson, who were fantastic against Leicester the previous weekend back at Old Trafford. Our captain Wayne Rooney in tremendous form. Four goals in three games, and it's Pereira. He gets his shot away, but it's a good save in the end. We've got a corner, though. Ensue to Downing. I was kind of surprised that Ensue started it right back to here. Please get that. Yes, well done. Well done. Easy, easy. Darmia finds Carroll for sure. That's a good cross for Downing. Poor finish, though, in the end. Schneidlin, we really need to be making our chances pay here. Oh, and Rooney on the outside of his right foot. It just goes wide. Down in. Oh, no. We need to be shutting him down. Oh, he's hit the post. Oh, my God. Patrick Herman. Oh, man. What a match so far. Back and forth. We could be on for our first goal here with Martial. Track that back. Oh, my God. How is that not going in or hitting the post? Oh, man. What? What a difficult game this. Oh, they're intercepting everything. They, we can't get our attack going. Oh, no. Stuani puts it wide. Still nil-nil. How a goal has not been scored in this game, I do not know. Maybe on for one here with James Wilson. Can we get past our man? Go for a bit of skill. Just drag the ball over. Here we go. Bit of space for Martial. Drag that back. Let's go for a shot on his left. And it's a good, solid save. Oh, here come Middlesbrough again. Where is Stuart Downing? He's caused us the most trouble in this game so far. There he is! Oh, he's hit the crossbar. My God. Still nil-nil, thankfully. I think it's fair to say now at this point in the game that Middlesbrough have been the better side. And I wouldn't be surprised if Downing makes it 1-0 here. He doesn't, but Adoma goes for the overhead kick. But it's easy for De Gea. Middlesbrough really mounted on the pressure now. We're just going to have to go for the point. That's a good challenge by Grenit. You've got to be kidding me. How is that a free kick? How is that a free kick? Grenit got to the ball. That was, a, that was a good challenge. How is that a free kick? I'm surprised it's not a red card. Totally with Grenit in there. Let's look at the replay. Had the ball. How is that a free kick? How is that a free kick? And what? Oh, it's Stuart Downing. Oh my god. I give up. I give up. Middlesbrough going to capture all the spoils here today because of that. That stupid decision by that stupid referee. No way was that a free kick. Get, the game should have been allowed to carry on. And now we've gone and lost the game. Absolutely outrageous. There should be an inquest over that decision by the ref. Disgraceful. Well, Stuart Downing got what he deserved. He really worked hard for Millsbrook. He got his goal, the only goal of the game. 
and got Middlesbrough the three points as well over the league leaders Manchester United not very happy with that really the game should have ended as a draw but anyway we've got to keep moving on thanks for watching guys see you all in the next one